Natalie's hooked up, something big. It's trying to take her towards the rocks. So she's doing what she can to get it up before it pulls her into uh, trouble. That right there would be trouble. Here in a second, I may have you turn around to your right and you're just gonna have to hold the rod and pedal away. I gave up the corporate life to pursue my passion for kayak fishing full time. And a few times a year, I head to Los Buzos Resort in Panama. There, I serve as a guest guide, helping anglers figure out one of the most epic fisheries on the planet. Trophy rooster fish, bro. The tuna, you got a tuna. You're watching Field Trips with Robert Field. The land of giants. Look at the Panama! I'm leading us in, is that what you said? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. For real. You gotta do your like. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Tubular. That, that was, was insane! Alright, let's do this, guys. Cheers. Salud. Cheers. Salud. Salud. Silencio. You just wanna retell the story, right? Silencio. Yeah. Yeah? Yep. That was maybe the craziest fight we've ever had yeah. by a client. For oh, sure, the most, the most epic rooster fish fight I have ever seen. Is Look that for real? Yeah, for your sure. face. Most epic? I have seen, I have seen almost two meter grown muscle, big big man getting flipped over, go overboard. And I handled it. And, yeah, I handled and I handled it. By a smaller rooster, actually. Yeah, a smaller rooster. And you, yeah, it's smaller rooster. And you handled it way better. But basically, what I was doing is I had a live moonfish on a hook that was I was trolling behind me really slowly. From here, we need to oh, give yeah. you. Yeah, you want to bait? Natalie's turn. She got a nice African pompano today. A really nice Jack Revol today. Two really good fighting fish. I think she's ready for a rooster or a kubera next. She kind of got her warm up in. Yeah, I'm nice and warm. Ready for a ready, ready for, for a trophy. Pez gallo. Yeah. More moonfish? Is that what we got? Yes. Yeah. They should be better here though because like they don't really live here, so it kind of oh. it'll stand out, you know. Over there, there's a bunch of them. Yeah. So it should do really well here. I would head closer to the rocks. Yeah. Okay. But again, not too fast. I've One. been kind of covering this whole area, and I've been marking more fish deeper. Yeah. But Okay. They don't seem to want to eat. We'll just go real slow. And then, yeah. This thing should, when they're being picky. I'll definitely head in there. Yeah, but just go slow. Like once it's in the water, you're fishing. And, and the water's so clear, they can see that flash from a long way away. So they'll oh. come uh, They'll come get it. All right. As long as, if you're going too fast though, it's not going to look natural and they won't hit it. So right. just take your time, yeah. And let out a lot of line, 100 feet, 150 feet. Good luck. So I start hearing the line just peel out. And they told us ahead of time, you gotta wait 10 seconds. Like 10 Mississippi. Which feels like an hour when the line is screaming off your Felt rail. like yeah. an eternity. So I radio in, and none of this is on camera, but I radio, I think I said something like, I'm losing line. Yeah, losing yeah. Line. somebody's taking it. Uh, right? I, heard, I, didn't, I, didn't, I, didn't. I didn't hear, I, I heard like something on the line. I'm like, be on that yeah. let's go. <laughs> what? Oh, oh, Repeat that, you say something stole yours? Natalie's on a fish! What? Natalie's on a fish. Let's go, let's go! 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 So my heart's racing. I set the hook and I knew immediately big fish was on. Yeah. It was like nothing. <laughs> that was big. None yeah, of the yeah, other yeah. fish that I'd caught. And we ran over in the boat as fast as humanly possible. Yeah. And when we got there, I mean, from like she was 500 yards fast. away, we were like, this yeah. is something big. Yeah. She, was she was hauling. Yeah. Just keep the line tight, keep the line tight. It looks like you start taking the rocks. Just uh, keep the line tight. Keep your rod tip to the front of the boat and it'll swing your bow around. Yeah, just like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll swing you around. If you get a free second, you can turn your rudder towards the fish and it'll help a little bit, but but don't lose the fish doing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a good fish. It, it... Everybody's fast! Yeah. Woo! Panamanian sleigh ride! Oh my god! You're going fast! Hauling yeah. directly towards the danger zone. Mm -hmm. well, I get on the radio and I'm like, what do I do about these rocks? She was like, hey guys, what do I do about the rocks? What Guys, do I do? The rocks! <laughs> the rocks! Huh? You're okay right now. You're okay. Las Rocas. Hey, Las Rocas, do you think she should turn around and pedal away? Natalie's hooked up, something big. It's trying to take her towards the rocks. Here in a second, I may have you turn around to your right, and you're just gonna have to hold the rod and pedal away. But you're right now, I think you're okay. Because they go around it. Wait, 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 wait. Before yeah. this, Kevin was like, you gotta get on this fish. You oh, gotta yeah, pump yeah, it. Yeah, pump. Turn and his head. I'm pump expecting some like, you know, pump some work in it. And I look over and she's like, 
Quickly. <laughs> and I remember at one point, like the camera drops because Kevin and I were just like, "Holy, <laughs> what, what is look at that? that?" We're like, "I am learning this bitch." She didn't learn that smallmouth bass fishing. Like, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, tricks she, up her sleeve. You didn't learn that in musky fishing. No. You, this, you bring that on the base, I think. Yeah. 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 It came she, from inside. Yeah, it came from inside. She fought that thing, fish yeah. unlike any client I've ever seen yeah. fight a rooster fish. Thank I've you. never yeah. seen anyone ever. Thank you. Not in your feet. Super impressive. Oh, real fast! Pump it hard. Yeah, yes, real fast, yes, do everything you can hard. to, yeah yeah, 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 now you're talking. Woo! Now he's looked yeah, up yeah, something yeah. big, trying to take her in the rocks. Like there you go, like, like a pro, look at that. Now we're talking. Yeah. You got it, you're okay. I don't know. Is there? She is fighting this fish like a seasoned veteran. Like, like a but pro. it still wasn't enough. This fish was yeah, like hell bent yeah. on getting yeah. into the rocks. We're that. We're if she like... got pulled in there, like yeah. serious injury is the only yeah. outcome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Close to the rocks, but she's doing what she can to get it up before it pulls her into uh, trouble. That right there would be trouble. But she's good. She's got it. Keep reeling. You're good. And yeah. this guy right here. This guy right here saved the day. Yeah, Pio yeah, saved the day. The captain Pio go around. Go around super close to rocks. I'm really like, close to rocks, and we look at each other like, like, "What are you doing? Like what is he doing?" Between rocks, the boat, the fish, and and Natty. So we're, I'm like, "Bill, what are you doing, man?" He's like, "Wait, I'm gonna scare with the motor." He's like revving the motor like from neutral, like boom, 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 and you can see on the video instantly. Like, he's the like, fish turned turn out. He turned his head. That is a trick I've never nose, seen anyone do. Out. Never I heard of that. Was happening. Never. I thought that I did some like amazing job to scare <laughs> the fish away from the rocks, but well, you definitely had it thinking twice yeah. with this. Yeah, I you mean, were he turning was, his yeah, head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. Yeah. You are fighting. It looks like a big fish, and you're fighting it like a pro. He's gassing, so he scares. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're trying to scare it away. Yeah, look. We got to turn around. Hey, it is professional, amigo. Wow. Keep the light tight. Keep the light tight, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's okay. You got it now. Let him run. Don't back off your drag, but... Yeah! Get him, Natty! Natty's hooked up something big! Try to take her in the rocks! We got the boat in between it and he peel rev the engine like a pro. Scared the fish out, it turned direction, headed back out to open water. But it's still putting a hurt on her right now. She is bent over. And then... And then it got uh, harder. Yeah, yeah it got that harder. One, that, and that's not the interesting part. <laughs> so, basically, so basically what happened, the fish was just peeling. And this went on for like a good 10 minutes. And I'm not kidding. It was the hardest fight of my life. Like every single muscle was just completely on fire. I've never worked so hard. And in the kayak, you're like, you have to focus on which way your rudder is turning. Yeah. And you have to fight the fish from the front. Because yeah, if you fight it from the side, it'll tip you. And like yeah. all of this is you have to pay attention to it's while you're like wind. trying not to to drop the rod yeah. and the wind's blowing and it was yeah. crazy and so I did something that I thought was really smart but turns out it's ill-advised in this part of the world oh uh, yeah uh, so the fish was just I couldn't the rod ended up hitting the side of the kayak which isn't good and so I knew I needed to lift it up and so I was gonna let off just a little bit of tension by dialing back the drag and Which is a sensible thing to do in but musky fishing there's is great. so much pressure when these big roosters oh. are pulling down and the mm -hmm. rod is locked against the gunnel that it's just a lot of force. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And so it went bad. I went I ended up with a bird's nest. You we looked over bird. and I saw her grabbing the line above I was the like, reel. It's still on, it's still and on. I knew something horrible had happened, and that's when we were like, no, 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 we gotta go help her. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, then see, hero number two comes in. Yeah, I see this this bird nest. I'm like, We were gonna pick it out. Yeah, I'm like, Pio, go, go, we need to help her to get get the bird nest out. And I'm like, go, go, go. <laughs> and we go really close to the kayak and we see this bird that's like We were like, oh never mind. Never <laughs> mind. Like, no, 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 let's handline it. We won't start handling that. Kevin fish. starts handlining hand it like, like a like champ. a couple of times and I can see that fish and I'm like, this is a huge one. It's a big line. Yeah. I'm like sticking my hands into the mm. water so I don't burn my finger. But she had it maybe yeah, she like, had like 15 feet below the yeah, kayak yeah, 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 when we first close. rolled up yeah. and it pulled some more. Yeah, we saw color right away when yeah, we Yeah, yeah, we knew it was a big yeah, fish. Yeah, yeah. She just got a bird test. It's all right, it's all right, it's all right. Oh, man. Is it there? Yeah, it's there. It's there. Try to fix your bird's nest while he, while he holds it. Or he'll try to land it if he can. It's so much. Oh, yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> okay, don't worry about it. He's tired. You 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 pretty much had him. So. I couldn't get the rod off the kayak, so I went to let a little bit of drag. Yeah. Gone. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah, it's yeah. a huge fish. I saw it. I saw it. He's coming. Yeah, I there. see it. It looks like a rooster. <laughs> looks like a big rooster. That was. This is crazy. Is it really? <laughs> yeah. It's huge. I saw it. Yeah, it's a big something. So much like. He's burning my fingers. Yeah, cuidado, amigo. Don't. Be careful. Be careful. Be careful. I did most of the heavy lifting, but that yeah. fish would not have landed in my lap if it wasn't for all of these guys right here. It was, work. and that just made the experience so much cooler. When I saw you lift the fish out of the water, yeah, yeah, yeah. you can hear I her just, in the back. Like I couldn't. I was just giggling. <laughs> she kept just, laughing. Like, yeah, just like didn't know what to say. It was insane. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Wow. Rooster. Yeah. Get the streamer. Yeah. Big guy. -o. Oh, wow, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Just come over here and get it. Come over here and get it. Yeah. Come over here and get this fish. Wow. Check that out. What a crazy fight. Oh, my God. Go get this thing, yeah. Oh, my gosh. That thing was... Oh, wow. Oh wow, that is a fish. That natty is a fish. Wow. Woo -woo. Hey, I'll, I'll get the I'll get the videos and stuff. Don't even worry. Look at that thing. Look at that thing. That is your first trophy rooster fish right there. Look at that. Look at that fish. Wow. Yeah, they're fighters, huh? Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, they're not, they're not done. Did he swallow it? Nicely yeah. done. What do I do? All right, we're gonna revive this rooster for now. Hey, my, me, hey, ow. Um, yeah, we'll get it, we'll get it. We just, they, they we gotta revive it, we gotta revive it, yeah, yeah, yeah. It takes a lot out of them, that was a battle. Took a lot of, out of you. Yeah, she'll be fine. She's biting me, she's biting me. Yeah, she's okay. She's biting me hard right now, ow, like it hurts. But I'm gonna keep going. Beautiful, beautiful rooster fish for Natty. That is, uh, her bucket list just got one fish shorter. That is for sure. Trophy Los Buzos rooster fish. We got it out, yeah, yeah. She should be just fine. Yeah, I know. Se fue or no? You see it? Yeah? Yeah? Yeah! It's gone! Yeah, they get it all. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Feel feel like a James Bond shit style. Yeah, con el motor. Wow. I'm like, Bill, what you doing? And he's like, look at this. Like, I am so grateful for all of you guys. I it really, just added to the experience. I am so happy you got it. And the team effort is it was. A, it was amazing, and I really think I mean, we were glad, talking about I'm it. Glad we could help 99 out of 100 that. clients, I think, would have lost yeah, that fish okay, before yeah, you sure. had a chance to even handle it. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank yeah. you. She handled it like a boss. It was but. really cool. This uh, it was definitely the fish that I came to Panama for. I came with an open mind. I wanted to catch kind of everything, yeah. but it was the fish that I wanted to catch. And having it in my lap, thrashing around, is an experience that yeah, yeah. really ties for first with maybe one or two others for the best fishing moments of my yeah, life. Yeah. And it was not a, a nice rooster fish; it was a trophy yeah, rooster. Trophy. Rooster it fish. was a trophy. Past trophy our rooster trophy fish. mark, yeah. And we I've caught with our streamer, I've caught yeah. multiple fish that I say like I'll never forget that for the rest of my yeah. life. But this is probably the first fish someone else caught that I was like I will never forget this yeah, for the rest of my super life. Super cool. It was cool yeah, to be a part of. That was awesome. The most epic fight yeah. I've seen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What you guys probably didn't see is that after I stopped hooting and hollering and smiling. The emotions I, cut up. I truly like broke down. And I've gotten like teary eyed from fish before, but I sobbed for like 
20 minutes. These guys came up after I'd already been going at it for like 10 minutes. I knew when I was calling on the radio and you weren't, you weren't answering yeah, and you weren't really doing anything. anything else. Yeah. It was like, it was obviously very totally like physically charged moment, but like emotionally charged too. And part of it just like, it's so fun and you feel yeah. so like gratified. But like, I also feel like it took, it takes a lot for me to be out there from like being kind of, being very scared, frankly, of like the ocean and just like everything else that kind of went in, that went into it beforehand. I've really never been so gratified by catching a fish. And I just felt like so grateful for, it was like, Everything that could have gone wrong, nearly went wrong. Yeah, and yeah. it didn't. And you still, it still worked out. It was like this moment of like everything just happened to be. how it was supposed to. It was so cool. You were in the Pacific Ocean, getting towed around by an enormous animal in a like little piece of plastic. In a little piece of plastic. If that doesn't make you nervous. You're not paying attention to what you're yeah. doing. It's uh, it's it's real. It was cool. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't stopped. Yeah, yeah. It was super cool. Today I won't forget. Yeah, me too. Today I'll never yeah? forget. Yeah? I'll tell that story too. A lot of clients. My grandkids. Bata like grandkids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bata Recuerda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what she said. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. All right, guys. That was awesome. Cheers to an epic Cheers. day. Salute. Thank you all so much. <laughs> This is only day three, which means that there's two more days left here, so there's more fish coming. Yeah. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. It's gonna be fun. The See you guys. Of giants. Los Buzos. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Kikiriki. <laughs> 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 <laughs>